Now, this one in connection with a big setback for Google. The Supreme Court has declined to stay Google's appeal against the Competition Commission of India. The order of slapping rupees 1,338 crore penalty on the company for exploiting its dominant position in the Indian market for Android. Let me cut across to my colleague Harish to get us the latest on that. Harish, good evening. Uh, we had, of course, seen this development in the past couple of days, but this is, of course, a big setback uh, for the company. Give us more details. Yes, uh, that's right. Uh, the Supreme Court has uh, refused to stay the Competition Commission of India imposing rupees 1,338 crore penalty on uh, the uh, Google for uh, wrongly finding ways to exploit its uh, dominance in the Android market. In fact, which powers 90, in fact, uh, which powers 97 percent of the uh, smartphones in India. Uh, however, uh, Supreme Court has uh, uh, expedited uh, the appeal filed by the Google against the Competition Commission of India in the uh, National Com Company Law Appellate Tribunal and has uh, uh, directed the tribunal to dispose of the appeal uh, within uh, March 31st by hearing uh, all parties on merits. But very significantly, uh, the Supreme Court has asked Google to pay 10% of the rupees 1,338 crore penalty imposed by the Competition Commission of India within a week. So, uh, in, in fact, during the uh, hearing, uh, hearing uh, uh, Supreme Court, in fact, uh, had made uh, several uh, key observations like uh, uh, look at the kind of, uh, said that, uh, look at the kind of authority uh, you wielded in the terms of dominance, look at the kind of authority which you wielded in terms of dominance, data indicates 15,000 Android models, 500 million compatible devices, 15,000 OEMs, when you have that kind of market penetration, then by insisting you necessarily have my bouquet for you directly affecting what the OEM does impact upon the ultimate consumer. So, <coughs> Chief Justice D.Y. Chandrachud, uh, Premefacy found merit in the conclusion of the <coughs> Competition Commission of India uh, while imposing rupees 1,338 uh, crore fine on uh, uh, the Google for exploiting its dominant position in the Android market. So as of now, it's a big, big setback for Google, uh, whose uh, this penalty has been, uh, Supreme Court has refused to stay the penalty, but however, directed the NCLAT to uh, hear their appeal expeditiously uh, within uh, March 31st. Back to you. All right, Harish, thank you very much for getting us the latest on that. Let's shift our focus to other news that we're tracking this evening. In fact, breaking updates in the... All right, so uh, continuing to track this particular story, we have uh, N.S. Uh, Napinai, the advocate of Supreme Court of India, joining us on the broadcast. Uh, Thank you very much for joining us. Your initial reaction about the fact that this is, of course, a setback for Google? Um, yes, indeed, it is a setback for Google. But I would say it's a very emphatic um, affirmation uh, of the effectiveness of the Competition Commission's order and the fact that um, these laws are going to be taken very seriously in India. As you point this out, right, going forward with the fact that uh, the Supreme Court has taken cognizance of this, if you could talk to us more on the fact that they were asked to deposit 10% of it. Hello? Can you hear me? Ma'am, if you can hear me. Uh, yes, I can hear you. Can you hear me? Can yes, I can hear, hear you. If you're talking about the fact My that, um, you know, obviously the, the Supreme Court, yeah. yes, I can hear you. The fact that it's exploiting yeah. its dominant position in the Indian market for the Android. So just to draw things into context for our viewers, if you could talk to, about, uh, mm -hmm. talk to us about the fact that the Supreme Court, um, you know, has also asked them to deposit 10% of the fine that has been imposed. How do you read into this going forward? So this is very uh, typical uh, uh, of an order. So when you're approaching a court, particularly on an appeal against an order, 
and where there is uh, an apprehension that um, you may be called upon, where the order may be confirmed, to put it more uh, mildly. And this is speculative. I won't say this is specific to this particular order. I'm just saying in general. So when it is something like that, then the court, it is open to the court to pass an order of this kind of um, uh, deposit. Therefore, uh, that would uh, possibly give the hope for Google to be heard, but not uh, it is not a reflection of what the final outcome will be. All right. Thank you very much for talking to us and breaking that down for us, uh, Naripini. Uh, appreciate you joining us, of course, on Mirror Now. Uh, with the fact that, of course, this is a big setback for Google, just to uh, draw things into context, the Supreme Court has declined to stay Google's appeal against uh, the Competition Commission of India's order of slapping rupees 1,338 crore penalty on the company for exploiting its dominant position, remember, in the Indian market of Android.